how do we put in the battery? Welcome back to my channel. My name is Alyssa, and today I'm going to be unboxing the Osmo Action. So, I bought this because Somebody was actually showing it to me and they were saying, oh hey, look at this, it's pretty cool. You can get some uh, six smooth buttery B-roll with it along with the DJI Osmo, which I've also ordered. And I was like, wow, I really like that it has a front camera. I was looking online and I saw that it was actually on sale and I was like, you know what? Shut up and take my money, I bought it. Let's unbox this. And get into it. So this Osmo Action has a dual screen, so it has a front screen and a back screen. It's a direct competitor with the GoPro. It films in 4K HDR, 4K EIS, 4K 60p, 1080p 8 times, and it also is waterproof. I'm not sure how far waterproof it is. I, I don't know if it's six meters. I can't remember exactly. So let's get this open. I'm so excited. This is my worst part right here. Getting this stuff open. So I really wanted a GoPro for when I'm back in Florida and I go snorkeling and do little water things. But I felt like the GoPro was pretty expensive. And this goes for a little bit cheaper than the GoPro, but it was on sale. And now we all know that free is my favorite word, but sale is my second favorite word if free is not there. Okay. Well, this is supposed to be durable, so I mean, I probably could have dropped it anyways. Am I like, doing something wrong here? I have to be, I can't be opening this right. No, it's the same way. Okay. Well, I just ripped the box open, so I don't hope that I don't have to return it. Okay. Okay. Ooh. Okay, so we have this little box. Oh, it was just the salt thing. So inside the box, we just have the camera and we have this little box which I'm assuming is the charger. So when I was reading reviews about this camera, I was reading that you can use all of the GoPro attachments. So if you do have a GoPro, have no fear. It's the same attachment. Wow, it's cute. It's a little bit heavy, I like it. So nice. I have no idea how to use this thing. Okay, so that's the... Let's see what's in this box. Okay, so... Here we go. This has an attachment. It's like a 3M attachment, probably like a, I don't know, some kind of helmet attachment or something. This has a sticker on it. And then we also have, there's another attachment in here. Sweet. This is the cable, presumably to charge. And then, I don't know what's, this is a little cute box. This is the battery. Sweet, cute little battery. Okay, and then we have this screw part, probably to mount, and then this micro USB cable. And then the last thing that we have is an instruction booklet. The writing is so small in this. Uh, how do we put in the battery? We don't know. 
There's a little lever right here. You just lift this like that, you flip it, and then the case comes off, similar to a GoPro. And then you just push the camera out. Well, actually, I don't know if you have to take this lens jacket off, but I'm taking it off. There's a lens jacket. Slide it out. Let's see. Battery slides in, like so. So I don't know if this is actually gonna work because it is probably dead. Ooh, nice. Well, let's get some ASMR here. Okay, so it's telling me that I have to activate DJI Mimo. I have to download the app, I don't have that up. So we have the front screen, the back screen. The little charging port is right here. And then when you put the battery in, it says to make sure that these little orange parts are not showing. So you wanna make sure you press the battery in as good as you can. So I'm just gonna charge this for a little bit because it is dead. Okay, so I have to create an account. And this is touch screen, which is nice. Yeah, so without the water, without an extra waterproof case, the Osmo Action is waterproof up to 11 meters, which is a lot. Sweet, so I mean, that was pretty much it. I mean, it's super easy to set up and you can go through custom modes, you can switch to different modes, and if you press the button on the side, you can go to, if you press the button on the side, if you just tap it, then you can switch to front view mode, so that's really nice. And this camera is supposed to be better than the GoPro because the stability option is supposed to be a lot better. It's supposed to be way more stable. So I'm really excited to test it out, and when I do test it out, I will post a video of it, but for right now, I'm just gonna let it charge, then I'll throw a memory card in it, and then I'll go around and I'll get some video. So I'm super excited. Thank you for watching, you guys, and uh, stay tuned. Please like, subscribe, comment if you want to see more unboxings or if you just wanna follow my journey. Yeah. See y'all later.